On June 21st, 1940, a 26-year-old black man in Laverne, Alabama, named Jesse Thornton referred to a passing white police officer by his name, Doris Rhodes. When the officer overheard Thornton and ordered him to clarify his statement, Thornton attempted to correct himself by referring to the officer as Mr. Doris Rhodes. Unsatisfied, the officer hurled the N-word at Thornton while knocking him to the ground, then arrested him and attempted to take him to jail as a mob of white men formed. Thornton broke away and managed to flee a short distance while the mob ran after him, firing gunshots and throwing bricks. When Thornton was wounded by the bullets and collapsed, the mob beat him with bats, then dumped him into a truck and drove to an isolated street where they dragged him into a nearby swamp and shot him to death. After lynching Thornton, the mob then went to his house and harassed Nellie May, Thornton's wife, for hours. The mob took a short break and came back to the house, abducted May, and threatened to kill her if she would tell on them. She left town. A fisherman found Thornton's decomposing half-eaten body a week later in the Patsaligo River. The NAACP's Birmingham, Alabama chapter investigated and with the assistance of Thurgood Marshall sent a report to the United States Department of Justice. Nothing ever came of it.